Oh my god! <laughs> Holy shit. What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Surprise! <laughs> We have decided to add a show, a nice kind of one season, 10 episode, nice quickie to kind of fill the gap while The Walking Dead quickie. is on break. Yeah, <laughs> while The Walking Dead is on break. And, you know, we chose this for a couple reasons. Obviously, there was no vote. Um, I don't even know if this show has ever even been in a vote before. Um, uh, actually, it might have been, might have been in the weekend vote oh, well, for I mean, Black it's Mirror. Like, it's new, right? Yeah. Um, but, you know, we get a ton of suggestions to watch The Haunting on Hill House. Did I say that right? Yeah. Okay. I, I, say, I, mean, I say it wrong every time, I feel we like. We get a ton of suggestions on a bunch of shows. Yeah. And believe me, we do keep track. We, like, yes. uh, we have a running list exactly. of shows. And, you know, but this, I just, you know, I hear so much about, like, you guys should watch, you guys should watch, yeah. you guys should watch. And believe me. I like scary stuff. I've watched many scary things with Nikki, and it is fun. It is a That's, lot of fun. He said it earlier, and I was like, what do you mean it's fun? You like to see me scared? Yeah. It's like, fun. you're such a douche. Oh. I was like, even when we're not recording? And he's like, yeah. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. And you know, this is a 10 episode first season and it's only been in, like out for one season. And you know, The Walking Dead's not on a super long break. So, so we feel like this is like the perfect kind of fill gap to kind of add a show, knock out the first season and you know, enjoy something scary while we're waiting for the return of The Walking Dead, which has been amazing. I so, mean, is this gonna be like one of those paranormal activity situations? I hope because so. I was not good with that shit. I mean, I literally <laughs> screamed in the movie theater. I was like, I was And I don't think those. we've seen any more of them because of that. Oh, you might have seen like the shit. second one, but yeah, I mean, she like when those people are like even just standing in the kitchen then all of a sudden a bunch of stuff just like falls off. I'm like, "Hit, hey, no, I'm out." I, peace yeah, I mean, <laughs> I get the I get the like I know nothing about this show except for the title and I'm going to just assume that there's going to be a haunting e either, of some kind. Either you you said it, it's either a house on a hill or the family name is Hill and their house and the family is haunted. Yeah. And that just sounds fantastic. Uh, which is also gonna make it really hard to walk around in, the, in this house. Because it makes lots of noises. In the dark. Because I swear to God, it sounds like somebody's coming up the stairs yeah. sometimes. And like, I'll be sitting in bed and I'll be like, I mean, even, even even for me, like, I'll be sitting on the computer on the bed, and where I sit on her bed, I could see right down kind of like a hallway that goes to the girls' rooms in the staircase, and I'll always just be kind of focused on the computer, and then I'll be like, did the, one of the kids walk in the hallway? Like, I'll see stuff over there, but, you know, I'm not as big of a believer in that stuff as Nikki is. <laughs> Um, so <laughs> part of the reason why I'm so excited to watch a scary show with her. Or when the kids it's, like stand at the side of the bed oh, and like, how long have you been standing there? Oh my God. <laughs> so I think this is going to be like the first scary show we watch on the reaction channel. Well, I mean like Stranger Things is kind of scary. Yeah, there's spooky stuff in there. You're right. But no but this like, is like ghost right. stuff, yeah. haunting stuff. Exactly. Like, I mean, zombies are scary. White walkers are scary. Like, but that stuff is all Headings. super, yeah, that stuff is all super fantasy. Like, the whole haunting and ghost thing feels a like lot more real. Like, it can actually real. happen. Yeah, it feels a lot more real than the possibility of a Demogorgon showing up from, like, the ground and eating your soul. Whatever, it could happen. Yeah, it so, happen. I'm very excited to watch the show at Nikki, and I know she's very excited to watch the show as well, because she has talked about it before. And you also, ready to jump? Oh. Wait, no, I'm not ready. Oh. I'm not ready to jump oh. into this. Oh. I want some comments about people's experiences and if they believe in ghosts and stuff. That'd be fun. Leave it in there. All right. You ready to jump I'm into reading, it now? I'm reading all of it. She <laughs> loves that stuff. You ready? Yes. Let's go. Watch you start watching. It had literally nothing to do with anything we just said. <laughs> that would be hilarious. I'd be like, shit. Edit that out. <laughs> yeah. Like, whoopsie. Hill House, not sane. Stood by itself against its hills, holding darkness within, and stood so for a hundred years before my family moved in. Oh my, my god! Might stand a hundred more. 
There's a house on a hill. Silence lay steadily against the wood and stone of Hill House. And whatever walked there, walked alone. Hill House then. And the music is super creep. <laughs> Okay, Sam. Go back to bed. Should I wake up mom and dad? I've got it. Okay, Nelly. You scared? That's okay. I get scared too sometimes. What was it? The bent neck lady. The bent neck lady? Fuck. Guess we better take a look. Here, huh? Thank God our daughters have never said anything like that after a scary dream. I'm sorry, if if one of the kids said this lady, I would be like, nope, we're burning it. We're burning the house down. Sorry, that's it. <laughs> you get back to sleep, both of you. Oh shit, no. I love you, sweetie. Mm mm. Don't close the door. Don't close the door. Don't close the door. Don't close the door. Oh god, don't close the door. Oh god. Are you fucking kidding me? Dreaming, Shaw. The pandas aren't dreaming. The pandas don't eat macaroni. What the hell? No good. Uh. Alright, I don't want to watch this anymore. I don't know. I don't want to watch this anymore. To the no. <laughs> this is fucked up. Oh, sh ah, shit. Fuck, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Hell to the no. No, no, fucking no. No, no, no. Wow. Ooh. That's some creepy You don't want to go to the movies with me. <laughs> you don't. You just don't. I, that is some I mean, creepy ass shit. I'm not like yelling and talking out of the movies, but God, I'm like. She's got a really mm. strong grip. Let's just put it that way. <laughs> like, <laughs> my arm hurts. Holy shit. Good. Oh my god. Like good I have start. You know what? I have indigestion now. Like <laughs> we're good. <laughs> I don't want to watch it anymore. We're done. <laughs> Thanks for coming, yeah. guys. Bye. <laughs> Cold open of the haunting of Hill House. Bye. Carl was driving on Rural Lady Six during the storm. Do you remember that storm? Oh, of course not. You were in LA. The car flipped over and you couldn't see it from the road, especially because of the rain. He was hanging there the whole time, upside down, tangled up in his seatbelt. They said he could reach the horn, but he couldn't press it for long because you see his arm was broken. Damn. And that's how he died. Upside down, pressing on that horn for as long as he could stand to. Oh my God. It started with drops of water falling onto my face. I started to hear a car horn. This was the night Hell after no. the burial, you see. And then I looked up at the ceiling, and there he was, hanging there, upside down. Oh my God. I could... Oh my God. And that was the last time I slept in that room. I can't promise I'll include your story in my book. Oh, of course. It's possible. What the fuck? So is this dude like a paranormal This is all author? your guys' fault. You suggested this stuff. <laughs> oh my god. They all just 
wanted me to freak out. <laughs> Our subscribers know you well. They do. Oh, there's a book. I'm sorry, I should have told you I'm a fan. Oh, Steve. I can't imagine so that's him as the kid. Oh. Famous haunted house in America. If you actually saw your husband hanging upside down over your bed, you've seen more than I ever have. The way you write, I just assume. Other people's stories. People like you, Irene. I give them the right voice, that's all. You know who I wish would write a book? Your dad. I'd rather sleep here in case she comes back. Yeah, so what happened to the dad? Hey, will you grab her blanket? So she wants to she wants his dad to write a book. So what went down here? What, what the fuck? What the f fuck no Oh my god Holy shit. I'm sorry. Uh, are you saying you'd prefer not to do a viewing? It's Max. I think he's just a little, um, a little nervous about it. It's important to say goodbye to Grandma. Viewing is just a way to do that. I don't need to say goodbye. Grandma keeps sitting on my bed at night. Oh, shit. Touching my hair. Nope. She just stares at me. I'm sure I'm you okay, Daddy? He's trying to fix the flu. The house doesn't like it, I guess. But Mr. Dudley found something for you. And I'm gonna need it back. Dude, this house is insane, except for, you know, <laughs> side neck lady. Bent neck. Bent neck lady. Yeah. Get it right. Mr. Dudley says this is a master key, so it's supposed to open any door in the house. What do you think is in there? This isn't working. It could be a pony. Something was moving. I saw the shadow under the door. Oh, hell no. It's been locked for years and years and years and years, so... I want to see what's in there, too. Daddy, we need more keys. It's an emergency. Nope, I don't want to know. I don't want to know. Oh, oh my God, there's feet under the damn pool. <laughs> Shit. I know. So, does this stuff, you know... Capture the supernatural? <laughs> don't believe in that word. There's natural phenomena that we understand, and then there's natural phenomena that we don't. Primitive humans used to die of fright during an eclipse. I have no idea what it was. Nothing supernatural about it, though. If he doesn't... He understood what it was. I just feel like he doesn't believe any of this stuff, so why would he natural. do it? I prefer preternatural. Probably because he's a good storyteller. Natural phenomena. And he could tell understand. other people's crazy stories. I just... But if you don't... Does it capture that? And it's probably profitable. Mm -hmm, that's true. How many books did he have there? Uh, no, Quite a few. No message. Just wanted to see if it was there. <laughs> profitable. He's got a nice Benzo. It's Steve. I'm sorry I missed your call. I talked to Shirley. I, I know you're worried about Luke, but I called his rehab center and he's fine. He actually got his 90 day chip today, if you can believe that. Liar. Um, I'll be around tomorrow if you still need to chat. I hope you're well, Millie. I mean that. I mean, this family definitely feels fractured. Oh, yeah. They definitely experienced something. Theodora. Oh, that's the little sister. Where'd you come from? That was really good. I have to work tomorrow. Don't gotta go home, but you can't stay here. Early. Oh. <laughs> Nell called me today. She sounded bad. Yeah, because it sucks to be Nell. We still haven't talked since LA. Theo. Don't. I'm just waiting for an apology. She said it was about Luke. Luke will show up when he needs Her. money. I just keep thinking, what if he doesn't?
<laughs> you got me. Oh, man. Nell? Dad, do you remember the bed neck lady? So, okay. Nell is the baby. Yes. Oh, oh, shit. Okay. I love you, Daddy. I'm sorry to wake you. Good night, Daddy. She's not in bed. Oh, oh, fuck! What is she doing? Oh, shit. Oh, this is gonna be a rough night. Stevie, get up. Dad? We gotta get out of here right now. What the fuck? Dude, that's just one of the kids, right? Where's the rest of the family? Get back in the car. I saw Lava Jill in the window. She was in the window. What's happening? My mom's. It's not mom. God. You get home and you stay with her. You keep your eye on her. Don't let her out of your sight. <laughs> Dad, I'm not hiding. I'll see you there. I'll meet you there. Uh. What the fuck? <sighs> Holy shit, man. What the hell happened to them? Oh my god. Is there a link in the ceiling? I know that she said that like she would feel the water yeah. on her face, but like maybe it's just a leak in the ceiling. Oh my god! <laughs> They're real good at that. Those jump scares, though. They're doing a real good job. And it's raining. Used to be a stop sign there until recently, yes? I don't know. It's a moderately trafficked area. A four-way stop without a sign is bound to have a few near misses. You're probably just noticing the car horns now because you're not sleeping as well. Things you used to sleep through. There's a leak in your roof. It was only drizzling last night and I even got a few drips. She doesn't accept that. Mm. And the man I saw hanging from my ceiling? The mind is a powerful thing, ma'am. Especially the grieving mind. Why would I want to see my Carl like that? Because it's better than never seeing him again. Hmm. The fuck, Steve? I, I sent you guys the manuscript in case you had any objections. I, I didn't have to do that. Of course we object. I object. Steve? Dad had every opportunity to set that straight. He said it was haunted. Those are his it was words. A wreck. He just lost his wife. He hasn't said shit since. 
All I've got are those tabloid quotes. He refuses to tell us anything else. He believed it, Steve. Do you know how much money they're offering on the advance? We can buy a house. We can move to L.A. We could... I need to start a real life for my own family. What are you doing to Mom? Mom was mentally ill. It's a fact. I'll be damned if the apple didn't fall too far from me. Ooh, wow. Shit. I'm, I'm sorry. What? I'm... No one else can corroborate your story, Hugh. That's right. The judge hears you talk about packing five kids into your car at three in the morning. They're going to wonder why they aren't hearing from those kids. We don't give them someone else. What to happened? More and more of this. It's tabloids. It's just tabloids. It's family court. I was never placed under arrest. It was a suicide. No one goes near the house. Just the police. Then sell it. You need the money, Hugh. I want the gates and the doors kept locked at all times. And I want to know every day that it's empty. No gardeners. The Dudleys stay on and it sits there and rots. Jesus. Hello, young man. That says you and Mr. Duck would come with the house. Houses like this one require a staff. So the people that lived here before us, the Hills, mm -hmm. so they were all alone? Oh, yes. They lived all alone. In the night. In the dark. Well, um... Well, they didn't seem to be too scared. I don't want to go in yet. I don't like it inside. No rush, my man. What happened to your other side? They all ripped it. Who's this? Some girl I saw by the woods. Oh, hell no. What's next? Oh. <sighs> I used to have imaginary friends, too. They go away when you get bigger. She's not imaginary. Where do you get the ideas for these drawings? Hell no. Hell no. The fuck? Did you tell Luke where I live? Did you bring him here? Is she a ghost? What do you want? Dad? I can't hear you. What the fuck? I just got horrible chills. Holy fuck! Oh my god. I've got horrible, horrible, horrible chills going right now. Holy shit. I'm not sleeping tonight. I'm not sleeping. <laughs> There'll be no sleep. <laughs> Probably shouldn't be watching this at 11 o'clock at night. Oh, God. Holy shit, dude. Wow. That was a terrible idea. Mm. I'm terrified. Oh, my God. I don't want to go in the dark by myself. <laughs> I mean, he got... He got a phone call from her. What in the hell is going on with this family? Why did she go back to the house? Why would you go back to that house? I mean, she said the bent neck lady was, oh, fuck. I mean, to have your children tell you there's a lady. Oh, my God. Okay, like, I don't know if, if parents out there. <laughs> My, well, I mean, started when she was like four. The night terrors. Night terrors. The most chilling scream you've ever heard in your she life. You better not have one tonight. <laughs> just I saying. actually might go get them and bring them in bed with us. I'm just saying. <laughs> Jeez. Um, that, that was. But no, but I thought. Somebody was getting her in her sleep. Oh, I yeah. saged this house. I sprayed a whole bunch. Which which leads me to something that I think we should talk about. 
what are your beliefs with all of this stuff? Like, what do you feel? Like, what do you think is real? What I do you think is not real? I think that there are some people that are more sensitive to these types of things. Um, I don't feel like I'm necessarily sensitive to some things. So, although last night I was washing my face and the water was running and I swear to God, I felt like somebody was standing there watching me. I swear <laughs> to God. Like I literally like turned around. I was freaking out. Like, I don't know what, like you weren't home. So I was but but that's the kind of thing that it makes me feel like maybe there's something because you feel like you're being watched. Yeah. Like it's a very I mean, that's eerie like very common. feeling. And it's yeah. it's woken me up at night where I felt like something's watching me, somebody's watching me. Most of the time it's, you know, most of the time it's one of the kids standing next to the bed, like staring at me, like willing me to wake up but it's like yeah i'm a little more on the skeptical side when it comes to this stuff like i felt like i've seen things i felt like someone's watching like i felt all that stuff before but yeah i don't i don't when it comes to like the to this level of like the hauntings and like the i don't know you've watched and I've watched them with you, all those haunted mansion and all those like haunted like location videos before. In which I don't think that that stuff. I mean, I think that's a bit. I much. think like, oh look, it something happened when the cameras were turned off. Right. I think most of that shit is scripted. Most of that shit is made up. It's sensationalized so that you think that they're really you know there really is something happening and maybe something is happening yeah but like for the most part like you get the idea that like that shit ain't that yeah. shit ain't real so still makes me uh <laughs> question darkness the ir it still makes me not want to hang my feet over the bed <laughs> the ironic thing is even though i'm skeptical i find this type of content to be the scariest yes it's like when it comes to like scary movies and like look at like like Stranger Things, for example, like that's really creepy. That's really freaky. Look at a thing like Halloween or Freddy Krueger. Like that stuff is doesn't do it to me. Like I enjoy that stuff. I find it very entertaining. But stuff like this, stuff like Blair Witch, like that kind of shit. Oh, where God. like I don't know why. Even though I don't completely like i'll never dismiss anything just like aliens like i won't dismiss them but like i'm skeptical um like i will never dismiss the idea of hauntings and ghosts and people being haunted by them but i find it to feel the most real when it comes to like shows or, or movies i don't know why like when 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 the dad said that she's dead i got this immediate like full body like chills sweating that just well no i got like a, like it was like a horror like it was it was scary and like my whole you body like i had goosebumps scared? well yeah that shit freaks me out like well i don't know you never act like you get scared it's no because it's because it's, <laughs> it's entertaining it's just i find it to be very entertaining but again my skepticism like put aside this is the scariest stuff to me when it comes to scary movies or scary tv shows i don't find a lot of other stuff that scary this kind of like supernatural and like paranormal type stuff like fucks me up a little. like it, I'll, I'll go put my head down tonight and i'll sleep fine i hope but like when it comes to like sitting and watching it it's the mo it gets my heart rate going like it scares me more than any anything else really. i know right let me see this no oh, okay my heart rate's fine but <laughs> Um, I want, I cannot wait to like watch this back and see how freaking wide my eyes got. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, this was a really good eyes first episode. Feel really dry right now. Yeah. Like I didn't blink. It was a really good first episode. It was, the story has me kind of hooked. I want to know everything that went down. Why did she go back to the house? Why do they all wake up at the same time being choked? Like that shit is like creepy as fuck. Like what exactly happened to their mom? How did she die? Like... 
Like, why were there tabloids written about this family in the oh, house? Like, happened? there's a whole lot of stuff that needs to be explained, and I am kind of hooked into it. I'm really excited about I it. I kind of want to watch another one, but it's almost 11.30. Yeah, we're night. definitely I'm, not watching another one. I am tired, and you're not going anywhere. You're... Yes. <laughs> we're going to the bathroom together. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Last thing, like, as we were watching the show, I'm, like, hearing, like, a creak there, a creak over there, a noise over there. I'm just like, mm-mm, it's not real. I know. Mm, if anything but, happened in the background, please let me know. Yeah, seriously, like something get knocked over. Like God, see, there's there's our elf buddy. Uh, yeah. I feel something in my hair. You're fine. <laughs> All right. Any other thoughts? No. All right, y'all. We'll let you know how we slept tonight, by the way, Ooh. in the next video. So leave them comments below. I want to hear all yes. the stories. Let us hear. Let, do you believe in it? If you do believe in it, what were your experiences? All of it. We want to hear it. We love hearing stories like this. So, yeah, leave them comments down below, and we will catch you guys later. Like, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications, and have a good one. All right? Sleep tight. Bye. Bye.